Hi, I'm Nonplan and today I want to talk to you about what's next for my channel. First of all though, let's address the elephant in the room. Where's the TSRE finale? To keep it short, still in the works. There are two main reasons why that is. This episode is gonna be long. And when I say long, I do really mean it. As of right now, the episode is around 6 episodes worth of frames, and considering it's not even halfway done, you can imagine why it's taking me so long. I've also been hella busy with schoolwork, hopefully I'll be back on track with it by the time I post this video. Now I've been asked many times what we plan to do after we're done with TSOE. Before we get started, please take everything I say in this video with a grain of salt. My ideas can change and so can my interests. Any ideas I show here might never see the light of day. With this disclaimer out the way, let's start with the most speculated series, Season 2 of The Emperor of Europe. Many of you have probably already watched Season 1 and desire Season 2. The series continuation is still uncertain, but with a map rework and a new name, we might just come back to it. Another idea I've had in mind for quite some time now is Pax Hispanica. What if the Spanish Empire never collapsed? If you don't already know, I'm currently learning Spanish, and exploring the different Hispanic cultures with this project would be really fun. I was planning for this series to include more of Americas and Africa, and to give those regions more love than usual, not focusing on Europe this much. Lastly, Vanité. Vanité is one of those ideas we've had as we are writing the script for TSOE. It takes place in a post-apocalyptic world after World War III broke out in the 1960s TSOE. Personally, I find post apocalyptic scenarios very interesting as many things can go wild there. Of course, as I mentioned, these are just some of the ideas we've had on our minds. I want to add one more thing. After the TSOE finale, you can expect another hiatus. Your boy needs a break too, and it will give us plenty of time to develop a cool alternate history scenario for you guys. Thank you for listening to my monologue, and I'm glad you're so patient with me. My heart goes out to all of you who supported me over the years. Peace, and stay safe.